What is going on guys? Welcome back to another fishing video. Today we are over at Mallard Lake. And I feel like every time we come here, there's never like a calm day. The wind's always picking up like this. The water's always choppy. Um, makes it kind of difficult to stay still and fish. But I feel like today could be a good day for a multi-species day. So I brought the drop shot, the crankbait, and then I think I have a chatterbait tied on too with this grass behind me. Right there, looks really good. So uh, try to fish that first and then keep going. Let's go. First fish of the day. I just moved over to this like windblown corner area. We got this guy. Let's see what he what he measures. I recently joined a uh, fat sack tournament, so I think it's best five fish. They said. That didn't work out. <laughs> My uh, identifier is not in the picture. Hmm, how am I gonna put this piece of paper on here? He was only 11 inches, but it still counts as something. All right, what a disaster. That's one fish down though. Within 10 minutes of being here, so that's not that bad. Put this away. Put my phone away. Let's see if there's more on this, this little spot. Gotta be more fish over here, right? I mean, hopefully bigger ones, that's for sure. Next cast, next cast, I think this is the better one. Or it might be like the same size. <laughs> it looks like the same fish almost. All right, I don't know how uh, dark I look in that camera up there but second cast next fish another little squeaker let's see if I can get a picture of this guy let's see looks like he's only like 10 inches <laughs> I mean, I have, like I said it's best five fish and these two the first one's not gonna count because they didn't get the damn token identifier on there this one is only 11 inches. That one. You can go back, buddy. Hell yeah. So I'm on the board with 11 inches. That was freaking next cast after that last fish. I'm just gonna find the bigger ones. And hopefully. Uh oh. I'm all tangled. Uh oh. Oh, uh, that's ripped. There we go. We got a lot going on over here. Um, hopefully. I can figure out how to put that token if it's a giant because I have it covering like the 18 and 19 spots so that could be an issue if we get a good one over here let's see if we can get one third cast that was sick like as soon as it hit the water that one's on it it's two casts come on two fish want this time.
Fish number three, windblown corners on the chatterbait. This one looks a little bit better, maybe a 12 inch. <laughs> uh oh, I'm uh, over in the reeds here. Fish number three of the day. That one was just below 12 inches. So that put me at two. Which is not that bad considering we've been here for like 30 minutes. If you guys look behind me, <laughs> look at the storm back here. It's not supposed to hit us or it wasn't supposed to hit us today, but the way it's looking right now, let me get my phone out real quick. <laughs> There's freaking clouds all around us. Thunder. It's starting to sketch me out a little bit. Hopefully it misses us though. Looks like it might. It's like just to the like west of us it looks like. Might miss us. But I am still got three fish in the boat. It has been an hour and like ten minutes. Switched a little bit of deeper water here. I'm in 16 feet running the deep T10. So getting this pretty close to the bottom. Got one on the frog. I missed two others. They came back here to this uh, weedy section. Got a decent one right here. It's in the case of a fighter and probably shaking all over the place, so it's not good. <laughs> Let me get my phone out, get a picture of him. 14 inch bass on the frog, and the frog popped out as soon as uh, I got him in the net, so that's good. This is actually the spot last time I was here, I missed the muskie on the chatterbait. The muskie followed it all the way up to the boat and uh, grabbed it. As soon as I went to set the hook, he like didn't, I don't know if he didn't get the hooks or he just got the, um, what's it called, the trailer or what, but, hell yeah. That's the first good one of the day, 14 incher. It is nine o'clock now. Looks like the storm just missed us. Like it was just, just, by us. Just sketching me out because I saw some lightning on the distance. There's a whole bunch of thunder. This isn't even actually my normal frog either. This is a busted frog that I'm using. It doesn't have like the plug on the bottom so it keeps filling up with water. Let me fix that. Alright guys, so my back camera just ran out of battery. I caught five fish today. Um, the one, like I said, the one picture, the like identifier thing wasn't all the way in there, so I'm not sure if that's going to count. But I think I, or I know, I'm somewhere over 40 inches now, which isn't a bad way to start the day. Like I said, I have a month left to get the uh, five fish limit, and I think I'm only like 20 inches behind uh, what other people have right now, so I'm sure I'll be able to call the rest of them out and get a good total. Right now I'm just messing around by these little pillars with the drop shot, seeing if I can pick anything off real quick before I head back. I actually just caught what I think was the smallest bass I've ever caught. I took a picture of it. I'll put it right here. 
just because I thought it was super funny how small he was. I barely even felt him hit. But yeah, I think that's going to be it for today. I will check you guys in the next video. Later.